Hello, this is Introductions here, along with a uh, another IOD, and more nature and random noises. So the IOD today is on... That's right, you guys guessed it. Adventure Time. And I know that's off-center. But anyway, so what this is, this air, uh, Adventure Time aired in 2010. Uh, it's a TV show. It was featured on Cartoon Network. Um, or was it? And, uh, by the way, it's one of my favorite shows. Ever. Ever, ever, ever. Anyways, it's a great TV show. I love it a lot. And I always thought that it was made in 2010. Actually, uh, this video here, I'll put a link to it in the description, it actually is proof of a much older series. Adventure Time was aired a couple years before 2010, under um under a thing called yeah as i said so a realization dawned upon me it was actually released a little bit earlier in i want to say 2008 before that called um on a show called what a cartoon or a random cartoon and um they just in that it uh the hero whose name is Finn you saw him earlier uh, he was named Pen, and he went off to save a princess from an evil ice wizard. And that is the basic definition of Adventure Time, or basic explanation. Anyway, so, um, that's what it is. It's about a young boy and his talking magic dog as they go and they fight evil. Anyway, so the TV show has had five seasons with 26 episodes each. And they are uh, currently on the fifth season, and they're working on it, and I'm watching faithfully. And uh, so they always end the season on a weird note, and then they make the next season. And uh, yeah, so now would be probably an okay time to explain what happened. Basically, in the magical land of Ooh, there are several kingdoms, one of which is the Candy Kingdom. Uh, there's a goblin kingdom, a fire kingdom, stuff like that, ice kingdom. And um, there are a bunch of princesses in everywhere except... I've never seen one in the goblin kingdom. And in the ice kingdom, the only person that's there are... Well, people that are there. There's an ice golem, who's awesome. Some penguins. And the ice king, who's like the main antagonist. He's a complicated jerk, as I've heard him described. And... um. So what happens is Finn and Jake, who don't live in any of the kingdoms, they live in a giant tree house. They um, go off and they rescue princesses and help people with their different problems. And that's how that part of Adventure Time works. Okay. So, um, basically, two episodes, Mystery Train and the Creeps, have a weird turn at the end, and they're not at the end of the season. So what it is, is in Mystery Train, it's Finn's birthday... Um, and he's, he gets taken to the train by his friend, and basically they solve a murder mystery on there, and it's very, very intense. And then The Creeps is basically the Adventure Time version of Clue, um, where they all go to a big abandoned house, and a ghost is haunting, is possessing one of them, and using them to kill each other. Now the thing with Mystery Train and The Creeps is that, after the resolution, in Mystery Train, what happens is the train derails and lands on a giant gelatin person, so it's all okay. But the tracks at the end are all frayed and stuff, and it looks as if it were sabotaged. And in the creeps, there's a really, really random ghost lady um, hiding behind bookshelves, and the ground tried to eat Finn, and the crows came from paintings, and it was all very creepy and all very real as far as the show goes. So these two episodes are pretty pretty strange and um, I'm just looking forward to the next one because I'd really like to see it. Anyway, so there's some intrigue when it comes to this series. Um, another two episodes called King Worm and Poi Poi, Poi, Pahoy, I don't know how you pronounce it, almost ended the series. King Worm made it seem as if an episode from a really long time ago actually was where the series had stopped and all of the things that had happened so far were just a dream. And then Poi 
made Finn go to a random pillow dimension, and he actually had a pillow family and pillow children, and that was really weird. Um, and they almost ended the series, because they were the most threatening to the idea of Adventure Time. So, um, I think that's about it. I just wanted to show you guys, uh, give you an intro to one of my favorite TV shows. It's really a lot of fun, and I love watching it. Um, and it's very... It's got some interesting points to it. So one point is this guy here. Uh, he's called the Magic Man, and he's from Mars, where Abraham Lincoln ruled happily for a long time. Yeah, so there's one. And another thing is this guy here, the Lich, who was apparently responsible for an atomic bomb that basically ended the whole world. Oh yeah, by the way, ooh, my best guess is that it's actually Earth in a much stranger form. Anyway, I'll talk about this later and all the different interesting things that come with it in a future video, hopefully. Um, but I just wanted to say uh, thanks you guys for watching and uh, being willing to listen to the I I these IODs. I will be pumping them out every week now. Um, I know they're called introductions of the day, but it's a uh, I O W, basically. Anyway, I'm just calling them that. So uh, thanks you guys for watching. By the way, next up is an I O D on William T. Lag, and I'm sure you guys want some answers as to why why would he do such a horrible thing as to create lag. Anyways, thanks you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. This is introductions uh, signing off. Thank you. Good night.